So interpret these latest headlines for us. Are we close to a deal? Good morning, Nera. It does seem we are now headed to a deal. Things are moving now quickly in Rome. We understand officials speaking to Bloomberg that they are ready to back Conta, the PD. Remember, this is one side of this hypothetical new majority. They are now ready to tell the Italian president they will back him to form a new majority in the Italian government. So you're looking at Conta staying as prime minister. A new majority, there is center left, and of course, Matteo Salvini forced and pushed out of office. Everything that could have gone wrong for Salvini has gone wrong. No question the biggest loser. And there's a lot of speculation here in Rome about his own political future. Maria, what is the financial solidity of Italy? It's an arch question. And you've been following this out of Brussels for years. Italy itself is actually doing financially pretty well, right? Well, that's right, Tom. And if you look at the market reaction, the market likes what it's seeing now because yeah. they believe that with Salvini out, all this talk about ditching the euro, leaving the euro, perhaps introducing the mini bots, all of that will be gone. And you're going to have a government that perhaps is much more willing to engage with Brussels. And we're going to see the escalation between the two, Rome and Brussels. The market really, really liking that this morning. And of course, you have to keep in mind that there is a theme of continuity. Con that will stay in office. And I have to tell you, I was in Biarritz over the weekend. European leaders actually like yeah. him. They trust this man. He's had a working relationship now with everyone in the European Commission. Macron, Merkel, there is really continuity in the market really liking that today.